Does anyone know about the Kessler syndrome? This is a paper from 1978 by a guy named Kessler, and he was thinking ahead about the problem of orbital debris. And the idea is that every time you have a collision, it produces thousands of additional fragments, which can then go on to collide with other things. So you can have this sort of runaway cascading effect where the time between collisions just keeps getting smaller and smaller and smaller and smaller until it's, so it's just kind of hopeless to have anything up there. It's what, 45 years ago? It's a while ago. He did predict there'd be like a giant collision before the year 2000, which didn't happen. He was off by a little bit. The big collision was this one. The Iridium Cosmos. Iridium. It's a constellation. And I think this was an active satellite, and the Cosmos was, I think, an unused Russian satellite. They're coming in at 90 degrees, and boom. That's the sort of predicted debris trajectories. So thousands of new objects that needed to be cataloged, and tens of thousands that weren't cataloged because they're too small, uh, were added to the debris problem. And you can kind of see, you know, after the collision, the center of mass is probably still moving on that same trajectory, roughly, for each of them. And the, it's kind of neat when you see up here, they, they kind of miss each other. But there could be a whole bunch of additional secondary collisions. I mean, it's shocking there are collisions. Space is big, but you've got plenty of time. And so now you've got all this debris. Unless we're careful about avoiding collisions or making sure things are removed at their end of life, you won't be able to do anything in space. This is on display at some NASA place. It's not that big. It's actually pretty tiny. This was experimentally done at, in someone's facility where they took a 15 gram piece of plastic, which means something the weight of an empty Dixie cup, and they hit this steel or something at 15,000 miles per hour. And this is what happens. So this is what a typical you know, tiny piece of debris will do. 